Hi. I'm Delaney. And I am Colin. I'm a bit of a picky eater. I think everyone has a food that they're just not gonna like. So, I've got the idea for a picky eater test. We made four signs. Marriott gives the food three points because you love it that much. Date it. You go on a date with it and then you just have a nice dinner. One night stand. <laughs> it gives the food one point. It means, meh, you, you'll try it. You'll have sex with it. <laughs> Reject it. <laughs> Zero points. You're like, no, oh. that's a bad idea. I would never put that in my mouth. Hell no. That's our four ratings. So I've got a list of 100 foods. There's a lot of food out there. So now we're gonna start. First one is beef. Beef. I'll marry it. It's not my favorite. Although, you know what? For some reason I, th <laughs> I thought there was a fourth one and so I wanted to go the level under it. Oh. So I'm gonna change my, my answer you to You revoked data. your proposal to beef? <laughs> I said no and it got down on its knee. <laughs> Next up, pork. Also date it. Yeah. You wanna go on a weird story time about dating pork now? Chicken! Chicken! Woo! I love chicken. I'll date it. Turkey! Turkey! Same thing. Poultry. It's all right. I don't know if you've ever had this one. Okay. Goat! Boop. I'll try it. I've had it Same. before. It was... Not my favorite, but I won't be like, no! Yeah, I don't know whether I like it or not, but I'll certainly try it. Next one, I don't know if you've had this one either. Lamb. I think I've had it before. What? Is As it literal lamb? As you probably lamb? have noticed, we are not vegetarian. No, I think I could be okay as a vegetarian, but I already I'd be dislike it. sad <laughs> for some time if I was a vegetarian. I miss you. I miss the romantic candlelit dinners with you. Venison! Deer meat. Deer meat? Deer meat. <laughs> Big surprise. I've actually had this. It was roadkill. My friend went hunting, didn't get anything. Hit a deer on the way. So the deer spent all of that time Avoiding a very highly trained person with a rifle. With a bow. And then they get hit by their car. <laughs> they just uh, say, something that's way headlights. louder and bigger and they faster. They jump right in front of it. <laughs> I mean, the deer at least had some afterlife. <laughs> Does that mean if we're eaten by a polar bear, then we've had an afterlife? <laughs> I'm at least contributing something. <laughs> I agree. Next, sausage. Mm, I've had it, I can't do it. I'll date it as long as it's not like super duper spicy sausage. You'll date that sausage. <laughs> I won't. <laughs> Bacon. Also, you have an eyelash make a wish. I could, I got it. Boop. <laughs> I just don't like the smell of the sea. <laughs> when my brother was like two, he told my mom, I don't like the nuts and the fish. Cause he got a bone in it and he didn't know it was a bone. He thought it was a nut. Stop <laughs> feeding your fish nuts. <laughs> Crustaceans. So shrimp, lobster, crab, oysters, mussels. Big surprise. No. <laughs> Calamari. Someone did make us try it. And I did not like it. Nope. All right, we finally moved on from meat. All right. Cheddar cheese. That's pretty good. I like it. <laughs> I rescind my answer one night stand. <laughs> you told it that you'd have a second date with it and then you just ghosted it. Uh-huh. Mozzarella cheese. Low fat. The only thing I don't like about it is sometimes you can just never break it. I mean, I'll try it. Ricotta. 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 Okay. For some reason, I feel like it 
to me, it doesn't have much taste. Yeah. But it's nice filler. I put cream cheese on all my bagels. You've had a lot more zeros than me. I'm a, I'm a picky eater, unfortunately. <laughs> this test is just to quantify that. Yeah, I feel bad because like I wanna, I wanna like more foods that people offer me. It's okay. Mm, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I like it as a snack that has protein. You can taste that there's not as much sugar in it. Did you have to drink a glass of milk every day as a kid? Because I did. Chocolate milk. Eggs. Eggs. Whichever way you like it. I'll have to go with this. If it's like the eggs that have the yolk that spills out and stuff, something about that doesn't rub sure. you the right way. It didn't rub you the right way and that's why you didn't want to. <laughs> we were in bed and then it got all goopy all over me and I decided I didn't want that anymore. <laughs> Why do you like me then? <laughs> this will be edited out. <laughs> <laughs> or will it? Why don't we move on? <laughs> <laughs> butter. I would not eat butter on its own. That's fair. Well, I mean, I wouldn't eat butter by itself either. <laughs> I was thinking. Well, the good thing, it doesn't have much nutrition, so you can just eat more of it. Boop. High in protein. Wow. When they're made right, I love them. I've just had very like dry and dense ones. If you put enough butter on them, then. It's, they flaked out on me a lot, <laughs> so I don't like them very much. Nice. Really? I thought you like scones more. When they're made right, the most of them are just really dense and yeah. hard. Pasta! Also rather high in protein. And easy to make. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Cannot date anything anymore. <laughs> oh. I've had it multiple times, but... The fairy tales don't do it justice. <laughs> or maybe they do, it just overhypes it. I know they're not a very healthy for you, yeah. but I love them. If it don't have high fructose corn syrup. Mayo. <laughs> not if it's spicy. I haven't had a lot of horseradish, but this is probably why. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Wasabi! The spicy stuff. <laughs> I don't like spice. Well, I like spice. I don't like burning my mouth. Speaking of spicy, hot sauce. <laughs> Big surprise. <laughs> Squash. 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 Yeah. Like the squash, I guess. I like it in stuff, but like a salad, just don't do it for me. Kale. I've not had it very much, but... I think it's more bitter. It is bitter, but it's healthier. Of course. Yeah. Cucumber. Now look who's getting more zeros than me. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, corn is good. Especially on the cob. Yeah. Potatoes. Potatoes. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're too excited. <laughs> yeah. I know they're better for you than normal potatoes, but something like just, eh. Broccoli is nice. <laughs> Eggplant. Look at eggplant. that. <laughs> eggplant. Sorry, eggplant. <laughs> <laughs> Like it's a very pungent smell that it is. just, I don't like. It's gotta be cooked. Just like the Grinch. <laughs> Max! <laughs> Level down. <laughs> I'm not really a fan of mushrooms. That's fair. Don't smoke them, don't eat them. Do you smoke? We can ask <laughs> my brother. <laughs> it's high in protein. You are also from California. <laughs> I must love avocados. Tomatoes. 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 
What? Raw tomato, not really, but I really like tomato sauces and whatnot. Your mind has been blown. <laughs> Berries. We're talking about like blueberries. We're talking about blueberries, strawberries, raspberries, huckleberries, marionberries. Mm. Mm, it's blackberries. Says the girl that would eat seven oranges a day. Oh, yeah. Especially <laughs> from California. They're nice, although I strike out a lot with the oranges. Here in Oregon, very <laughs> sad oranges. Apples. Apples to apples. Good with peanut butter. And honey. Bananas. Look at you, son of the allergic to bananas man. My only exception for bananas is like banana bread. Because that is so good. Melons! Are we talking about just watermelon? Or... Watermelon, cantaloupe, honeydew. They're all right. Sunflower seeds, pumpkin seeds, chia seeds. Ah. I don't really like seeds. They're nice. Peanut butter, peanut, peanut butter, butter, peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter. Peanut butter. Pretty good. Donuts. I used this to This is really like, like for Krispy Kreme donuts. Like other kind of donuts kind of just sat at me. Ice cream. Ooh, ice, ice cream. cream. <laughs> Especially yes. chocolate. Ice chocolate ice is cream. the best ice cream. Ice cream, ice cream every night. Every morning. Pudding. 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 It's good. Chocolate pudding. <laughs> or vanilla pudding. For me. At Chocolate least. pudding. <laughs> Chocolate. <laughs> He's so funny. Just kidding. <laughs> Chocolate. <laughs> we eat more chocolate than is probably good for us. Where's the four card? <laughs> they good. When I was younger, this might have been higher, but... Pie. Pie. Now this is difficult, because there's a lot of kinds of pies. Pie's good. Cake. Cake. This is where the three pops up for me. <laughs> I think there comes a point where my body can't handle any chocolate anymore, and that's like after one brownie. I'll eat your brownies, and you can have my cake. Sounds good. I love cookies. Just, they're soft and those are really good. I'll have the burnt ones. <laughs> We're getting close, I promise. <laughs> mint is good. Especially buttermint. Or like the Ghirardelli chocolate mm -hmm. mints. Yes. There's one more. Can you guess what it is? Is it a sweet? Yeah. I think like jam, because we haven't talked about that. Yeah. Gum? Gum! gum. <laughs> We're gonna rate gum even though you shouldn't swallow it. Gum. Gum! <laughs> <laughs> yes! We did it! <laughs> we did it! Yeah! Now I'm gonna math. Are you sure? Wow. <laughs> Well, we just calculated our answers. And blew Delaney's mind. <laughs> blew my mind. <clears throat> so do you wanna reveal our scores? Yes. I got 163, which isn't great, but is still a little bit <clears throat> above the halfway mark. And I got 158. He's more Picky than me. Somehow. Pickier, pickier, pickier. See, like on meats and stuff, I'm less picky. But then on carbs and veggies, she's less picky. And then on sweets, she's definitely not as picky. I think the problem is that you're more often gonna run across the food that you like in restaurants and homes, whereas I just want to go to a garden and pig out. <laughs> so linked below is the chart that we just followed to rate our foods. You get 300 points. Wow, you like everything and that's pretty cool. If your score is zero, I don't know how you're alive. <laughs> I clearly missed an important category there. <laughs>
I think it would also be pretty cool if someone like drew their customized food pyramid. Like if I did that, it'd probably just be fruits, veggies, and desserts. <laughs> Meats, desserts, veggies. How many spouses do you think you have food-wise, not counting me? I'd say 18. 19. Cool. Guess how many I have? 22. 20. <laughs> <laughs> You're pretty close. Anyways, thank you for joining us. Yeah, thanks for joining us. Please comment below what your score is. Let's yeah. talk about food. What super niche food item do you like that we did not talk about? Yeah. Do you want us to do tests like this in the future? Or are you just bored out of your mind looking at us for this long? <laughs> you can click away. What are you still doing here? <laughs> All right. Guess we'll see you next time. Bye, guys! <laughs> <laughs>